Hello everyone, it's me Steve with Mr. Jen All in One. Guess what we're gonna do today? No, we're not gonna do workout. No, I don't do workout. <laughs> so we're gonna do something very exciting for summer. The most important thing for summer is have a beautiful tan. And where are you gonna get tan from? The sun. Even in Southern California, day like this, you won't have any sun. So we have a spray tan expert, Stephanie, here, going to show, show you how to create a beautiful tan without any sun. Not to mention, when you get tan from sun, you're going to get sunburn from UVB and aging from UVA. So with a spray tan, we won't have that issues, right? No, you will not. It's actually, the sun, as many of us know now, is so damaging for your skin. It creates sunspots, mm -hmm. you know, causes cancer. So the best thing you could do for your skin, if you want color, is spray tan. Um, you can, And the best thing about spray tan is you could do it all year long. You don't have to I wait see. until the sun's out. So you can have a nice tan and color all year long. And then most of you has the most question is that if I get spray tan, would I get orange on my skin or not really? Um, it depends on the product that your spray tan technician mm -hmm. is doing. Usually a lot of the at-home products tend to go on more on the orange side. What we use, doesn't matter how dark you want to go, it does not get orange. Okay, mm -hmm. so Stephanie, I actually have a model here that we're going to demonstrate how to get a beautiful tan. So let's see. Stephanie, so can you give our audience a couple tips that before you spray tan, what a must thing that they have to do? Yes, so the most important thing about spray tanning is the preparation. Okay. You really want to prepare your skin so that after you spray tan, it lasts longer. Okay. So it really depends on how you prepare. If you're, if this is a special occasion, if you're spray tanning for a wedding or for birthday celebration, any special event, you most likely you'll be getting your eyebrows done, manicure, pedicures, waxing. So if you're going to do any of that, you need to do it at least 24 hours before the day of your spray tan. Okay. Now the day of your spray tan, we want you to exfoliate your body, exfoliate all your skin, um, your face, everything, everything you're going to get spray tanned. You want to take as many dead skin cells as you can off of off of the top layer of your skin. That way the spray tan solution could lay on, on your naked skin and that helps it last longer. Okay, great. And um, the boots right here, it's portable, as you can see right here. What is what Stephanie do the best is she will go to your house, bring this baby right here and you can spray tan any location. So if you want to look like a movie star, superstar, you gotta call Stephanie for spray tan. <laughs> The day of your spray tan, do not wear any lotions, okay. no deodorant, no perfume, bare naked skin. Naked skin. To get the perfect tan. Perfect. And your face. Now that Stephanie has completed the uh, spray tan on the model Sunny, and finally we get to see some six pack there now. Mm -hmm. So if you want her beautiful six pack, call Stephanie. She can create that, right? Definitely. <laughs> we could do some contouring Abs of the body. Absolutely. So can you tell our viewer that what is that he needs to do after he gets spray tan? So once he spray tans, he needs to you need to be sure to wear something loose and mm -hmm. dark. Um, that way it doesn't, the color doesn't get on anything and doesn't mess up your clothes. Although it does wash off, so don't worry if it does get on your clothes. Okay. Um, but something loose that doesn't rub on the skin. That way he doesn't get any, any blotches or any spots. Also, no shower or no water, no contact with water in at least four to six hours. Four Preferably six hours. full shower at least six hours. Okay. Yes. And it's true that after he took a shower, you'll come out some color. That's normal. Some color, yes. Actually, right now we just did the spray tan. In about four hour, four hours, he'll be a little bit darker. And once you shower, you see the first layer come off. And that's basically just the bronzer that's the guide for to spray tan. I so see. don't worry if you see some color in the shower. After the first shower, that's the color that stays on approximately seven to ten days, depending how long wow. how you take care of it. Very it could last up to two weeks if you once you get used to it. Very good. So I wanna show you guys that. Can you show guys the tan color on your you can see it? That's pretty amazing. So I want to thank you, Stephanie, to come to my show today. And I want to thank you, thank Sunny, to being here to be our model. And don't forget to subscribe and share Mr. John All-in-One on your Facebook page, too. And we'll see you next time.